UST's website. Oh, that looks really good, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's go back to the year Margaret Thatcher was re-elected for a third term. A hurricane hit the south of England, and Rick Astley's Never Gonna Give You Up was top of the charts. You normally sing those bits. I know. Okay, well, it was 1987, and five-year-old Ian Frith was being taken by his grandma on bus trips around Sheffield. Oh, the fun he had on those days out sparked a lifelong obsession with buses. He's now only 30, and he already owns 25, or he has owned them in the past. But the latest one we know is a bit special. Olivia Richwolf has this. Ian Frith works on the railways, but his passion is buses, especially this one. The Little Nipper was introduced in South Yorkshire in 1987, a new type of bus it was nimble enough to serve the estates, and Ian and his grandmother used to take trips on board every week. This is my big top. This is my train set from when I was, you know, five years old. Ian has spent thousands of pounds buying and restoring the Little Nipper. Today he's taking it back to Sheffield for the first time, and there's one very special stop along the way. I brought it up here to have a look. Well, do you like it? What do you think? Looks a lot nicer, doesn't it? Took ten years to get it. Today's trip back to South Yorkshire is one of the biggest days for me. Um, bus left in 1996 and to take it back to its hometown and be the only one left. I can't express how it feels. The Little Nipper bus was in service across South Yorkshire for almost a decade. 179 of these buses were originally made and only one still works this way. <laughs> one with fond memories of the bus. On its way, the Little Nipper picks up friends and fans. I think it's uh, historic. It reminds me of uh, buses I used to get on when I was a child going to school. Yeah, it uh, shows you how far things have come. <laughs> Charlie and Rebecca waited an hour for a look. Charlie's dad told us um, that he used to go on this bus and uh, about the restoration, and Charlie's very into your bus, isn't it, Charlie? You can see a lovely enthusiast there. It's such a young age. It's, it shows that the hobby is far from, from dead. And so, with the next generation now hooked, the little nipper is off. Olivia Richwald, BBC Look North, Sheffield. You see, I could say from a bus called a little nipper to a weatherman, but I wouldn't say that, would I? You look like Ollie's. <sighs> okay. That was a good one, was that? Yeah, no, 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 no. Two picture. 